Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see an activity for class 12 Applied Mathematics. This is an Excel activity number 9. In this activity, we are going to calculate EMI and also going to prepare a balance sheet. EMI is a monthly payment which we pay towards the loan amount in a certain period of time with some rate of interest. For that, you will be given a question like this. Calculate EMI for the amount of 2 lakh at the rate of 18% per annum for the year. For the year, the payment should be made monthly. Calculate EMI and also prepare a balance data sheet. So, the loan amount which we take is 2 lakh. And the tenure period, time period for repay the amount is 1 year. That's why it is mentioned for the year now. So it is one year. And it is mentioned in the question very clearly that the payments are made monthly. So every month you have to pay one installment. So for one year, 12 installments. Then the rate of interest is 18% per annum. For the whole year, the rate of interest is 18%. As it is pay, to be paid monthly, this rate of interest first should be converted according to uh, as per the convenience of calculating the EMI for each month. So the per month interest should be calculated. For that what we are doing, click the cell next to the rate of interest, put equal to, click the rate of interest, slash 12, enter. You will get the rate of interest that is 0 0.015. This is the rate of interest per month. Now we are going to calculate the EMI so monthly payment monthly payment this is nothing but EMI so to calculate this EMI I gave you a syntax here EMI equal to PMT open the bracket rate of interest comma number of installments comma loan amount comma zero put enter so we are going to prepare the EMI now put equal to Open the bracket, click the rate of interest per month, okay, per month, comma, number of installments, 12 installments, so click that number 12 over there, comma, loan amount, this loan amount, comma, zero, put zero, close the bracket, enter. I didn't give PMT. We should type PMT in the front. So the syntax is equal to PMT. You can see here equal to PMT open the bracket rate of interest comma number of installment comma loan amount comma zero then put enter. You are getting minus 18336. Why minus is displayed here? Because 18,300 should be detected every month from your loan amount. So it is showing minus symbol here. So this is the EMI per month. So if the question is about calculating EMI till this you can do it's enough. But I am asking you to prepare a balance sheet so that you can build us with the uh, process. Now I am going to calculate this. 18,336 is the monthly payment. So first month zero at the beginning you are not paying any money. After a month only you will be paying the EMI. So first uh, the, the time when you take the loan it is zero period. In the first period 18,336. This is the amount which you are going to pay for all the 12 months. Equally you will be paying 12 months each month that 18,336 only. But this 18,336 will not be directly deducted from this 2 lakh. Some amount will be gone for interest and the remaining amount only will be taken or deducted from the present value. So that is called interest amount. Click the interest cell equal to present value into the rate of interest. What is the rate of interest per month? 0 0.015. Click that cell. Put enter. You are getting the interest amount. So... The amount to be detected from the present value is click the EMI minus 
this interest enter 15,336 only. Even though you pay 18,336 per month, in the first month, only 15,336 will be deducted from your present value. That is the loan amount. So, for getting loan amount in the month of uh, end of the first month, the present value, that is the loan amount, minus this 15,336 enter. So, this is your balance after one installment same way the next interest now the present value is only 184000 into the rate of interest you will get the interest rate so now it is equal to the emi minus interest enter this amount should be deducted from the present value minus this value enter now equal to present value into 0.015 interest now it is equal to emi minus interest enter now equal to present value minus remaining amount deducted enter same way equal to present value into 0 0.15 enter equal to 18336 minus 2299 enter equal to equal to present value minus this amount enter next equal to present value into rate of interest enter interest equal to emi minus interest enter equal to present value minus this amount enter equal to present value into rate of interest enter equal to this amount minus interest it is to be directed equal to present value minus remaining amount to be directed enter so seventh month also equal to present value into 0.15 enter here this to emi emi minus interest remaining amount to be paid so this paid amount should be directed from the present value minus this value enter equal to equal to present value into 0 0.15 enter here equal to this minus this is enter here equal to this minus this is enter here equal to 70 into 0 0.15 enter EMI minus sorry equal to EMI minus interest equal to 17,000 which can be directed from your total so again 53 into 0 0.15 enter so equal to emi minus 1800 enter total amount minus this amount enter 
here equal to present value into zero point one five enter here EMI minus interest equal to equal to and now again equal to 1865 this final amount into the rate of interest this enter remaining amount equal to this minus this enter equal to present value minus enter so in 12 months all the amounts are deducted only two rupees is there like this you can prepare the balance data table so all the required formula are given in color and the right side writer part is given in word and the left side excel also given here so hope you will understand you would have understand how to calculate EMA using Excel and also how to prepare a uh, table for the required question. Okay, all the best. Bye-bye.